So, I know I'm a little tardy to the party, but I finally got around to seeing Bad Boys Ride or Die. And I will say, I've said it once, I'll say it again, but I honestly think this one should have been called For Life, and the previous one should have been Ride or Die. That's all I'm gonna say. Uh, it just makes sense, right? Like, come on, guys. Uh, you had one job. But, this movie is, in my opinion, the best of the Bad Boys franchise, and I think that they're actually getting better in quality in all sorts of the word, like, storytelling, action... And just, like, fun. <laughs> it This one was definitely the most fun. This, let's just get right into it. The story is pretty simple. Our bad boys, Mike and Marcus, are trying to uncover and prove that the police captain was innocent and not corrupt. And so they go through a lot of hurdles to get there. But it's a fun tale the whole way through. And honestly, the story is great. I, I loved it especially in terms of bad boys, so hand grenade scored there. Uh, the cinematics, my goodness, the music, as always, pumping, very good. The action sequences, amazing. There was one that they uh, Will Smith posted a behind-the-scenes of that, oh my goodness, like, seeing that on the big screen was awesome. That sequence alone was enough to bring it up to four and a half. Like, it, it, it boosted it up like a whole star, honestly. But, yeah, amazing hand grenade score. The directing, very solid from our little duo here. It really uh, makes me sad knowing that they are their Batgirl movie actually got shelved because it probably would have been just as fun as this. But, uh, so is the case. This movie was awesome, and I hope they keep making action movies because they're really good action directors. The cast... This was Martin Lawrence's time to shine. My goodness, he ate, both figuratively and literally. Like, there were so many scenes where he was just trying to consume food, and it was really funny because the, the whole his whole character arc is about being on a diet. <laughs> and I don't know why, but that's just funny, especially since everyone else is policing him. And, oh my god, and Will Smith, of course, great times from both of them. They do phenomenally in this film, and honestly, I, I would be down to see more. Hand grenade score. And yeah, overall, expectations, experience, solid. I was not expecting it to be this funny. It was way funnier than I expected, and I had a blast. So this is a certified hand grenade movie, and yeah, that's pretty much all I really have to say about Bad Boys Ride or Die. So if you are still watching, leave a like, comment down below if you checked it out or not, and subscribe if you haven't already. And other than that, I'll leave you guys to it.